There is a concept um, called the infinite game. Um, a finite game is something with known players, fixed rules, and an agreed upon objective. You know, baseball, football, there's a beginning, middle, and end. And then there's something called an infinite game, um, where there are known and unknown players, uh, the rules are changeable, and the objective is to keep playing, to perpetuate the game. Um, what's interesting is we are completely surrounded by infinite games. Um, there's no such thing as winning marriage. Um, there's no such thing as winning therapy. Um, there's no such thing as winning life. You know, if you ha make more money than all your friends, you don't win. Uh, and there's definitely no such thing as winning business. They are infinite games, and there are many other infinite games that, that in which we are uh, players uh, every single day of our lives. The problem is, is too many people play in some of these games as if they were finite games. Uh, if you think about how too many uh, CEOs or, or people in business talk about their business, they talk about being number one, being the best, beating our competition, based on what metrics, based on what time frames, and no one else has agreed to those things, which means there's no such thing. Um, and so what I learned is that when we play finite game, when we play infinite games with finite rules, eventually we run out of the will and the resources to play. The resource is obvious, you go bankrupt, but will is sometimes we burn out and I just don't want to do it anymore. So you might make tons of money, but you're just like, I hate this and I don't want to go to work every day. Um, and so we have to learn to adjust how we lead our organizations um, so that we play the appropriate way for the, uh, for the appropriate game.